This document is about how to determine the precision measure of analog scales. When you have a measuring instrument that's not digital, or that we call analog, then the precision measure is half of the space between divisions on the scale. So I'll give you some examples. Here we have a meter stick, where these are centimeters, and so in this one centimeter there are ten divisions, or ten divisions in ten millimeters. That means there is one millimeter per division, and so the precision measure is half of that space between the divisions, or half a millimeter. Here we have a graduated cylinder. And so in this case, in the graduated cylinder, here we have a difference of ten milliliters, and in those ten milliliters, we have ten divisions. So, we have one milliliter per division, so which makes the precision measure half of that, or 0.5 milliliters. Here we have a thermometer and we see for a 10 degree span we have 10 divisions so again the precision measure is half a degree because we have one degree per division here we have a graduated cylinder again but in this case it's not 10 divisions in 10 milliliters so we'll look a little more closely looking at it a little more closely we can see that we have 10 divisions in 5 milliliters which means that each division is half a milliliter so the precision measure is half of that, which is a quarter of a milliliter. Here we have three spring scales that all measure in grams, but they all have different precision measures. Here's the first one. So we see here that there are 10 divisions here, and since this is 200, then this is obviously 100 grams, we have 10 divisions in 100 grams, which means there's 10 grams per division, so the precision measure is half of that, or 5 grams. In this case, with this spring scale, we see we have 10 divisions in 50 grams, which means it's 5 grams per division, or the precision measure is half of that, 2.5 grams. In this case, if we count divisions, we have 5, 10, 15, 20, 25 divisions in 50 grams, which means it's 2 grams per division, or we have a precision measure of 1 gram. There are some devices like this that have multiple scales on the same device. So here we have a voltmeter that has one range from 0 to 500 volts and another range from 0 to 150 volts. In this case, the precision measure depends on which scale is being used. So the precision measure of this inner scale is not the same as the precision measure of this outer scale. One thing that you might see occasionally is a device like this that has varying divisions. If you look at this scale, you'll notice that it's not linear. So at this end of the scale, we have 5 and 10. There's only one division between them. As we go around to this end, we see we have 4 4k, which is 4,000, and 5k, which is 5,000. So in this case, we have one division between 4,000 and 5,000. So at this end of the scale, half of the space between these divisions is 2.5 units. At this end, half of the space between these two is 500 units. So in this case, the precision measure depends on where the reading is on the scale.